when you're at the checkout, get a piece of paper, put it up here, because there's a camera there, and it watches you. So, I'll just show you, I'll just move it. Let's see. So I'll just do that every time now. And now they've got this. See how it's got the green light? It's open. You can walk out, but it can shut on you. They say it's for theft prevention, but we know what it's really for. It's to prevent the non-marked when the time comes from doing their grocery shopping. No right, Lola. Hello, gorgeous. <laughs> Lola's always making friends. <laughs> God bless you, young man. Have a beautiful day. Praise God. He's accused of walking off without pain. And hot on his heels is a man who catches thieves for a living. Don't give me money. You're trying to bribe me. I've got 11 shoplifters in eight-hour shift. It is the craziest I've ever seen shoplifting in my life. And I've been doing the job over 30 years. All right, I'll get all the stolen stuff out. Woolworths is trialling its latest weapon to combat shoplifting. And because I haven't paid for my goods, the, the exit gates won't open. Rooftop sensors track the customer from the self-checkout to the exit, targeting those who pretend to pay or just walk straight out. We've seen an increased activity of non-paying customers, unfortunately. Shoplifting costing Australian retailers an estimated $9 billion a year. As cost of living bites harder, meat has become a prime target for thieves, not to eat, but to take their cut from selling it on the black market. I got a shoplifter yesterday, stole $500 worth of meat. She told myself and police she was supplying a restaurant in Canberra. Forcing supermarkets to beef up security. Amy Clements, 7 News. But then what happens is the Walgreens Corporation, that means the employees will have to show up to court and testify, and I think that's where the, the particular problem is. It's tying up their employees to go to court on these, you know, on these retail thefts. Walgreens isn't the only retailer facing a shoplifting problem. This Safeway on Webster Street in San Francisco joined with others in Oakland and San Jose to install these glass gates where shoppers have to scan their receipts to exit. Safeway released a statement saying the grocery chain recently made the change at select Safeway stores in the Bay Area to maintain a safe and welcoming shopping experience for customers and associates given the increasing amount. I don't believe that because it's easy just to go in and buy one small cheap product but then shoplift a whole bunch of other stuff and put it in your in your pants in your pockets in your jacket wherever just scan the receipt for the one little thing that you bought and those gates are going to open up for you even though you've got a whole lot of stolen stuff on you. So I don't believe that these gates are really to stop shoplifters. Nice um, Lucifer race blue colour on the edges of the, the gates. We see what's going on. Hold on to Jesus.